Hey there, welcome to Old Man Runner. In today's video, I'm gonna try and figure out which burns more calories per hour, cycling or running. To do this, I'm gonna race my friend Con around the Phoenix Park. I'd be running, he'd be on his bike. Uh, the loser will buy uh, the winner the calories they consumed in the hour at the Dash Container Cafe on the edge of the park. Uh, then I'm gonna chew over the data, come up with some conclusions, and hopefully Con will be eating some humble pie. <laughs> A few weeks ago, I got a call from my friend Declan who said that uh, he <laughs> surprisingly watched these videos uh, with uh, his friend who ran the Dash Container Cafe on the edge of the park. And they, um, they kind of target cyclists and runners because they're literally at what's called a hole in the wall in the park. And you go through, run around the park, and it's a great place to, I suppose, load up before or afterwards. And I've been interested in making a video for quite some time about how many calories you burn. And in previous videos, I've sort of talked about how if you burn enough calories, you can eat wherever you feel like. So I decided to go to the uh, park and make a video. Um, and first I decided I was gonna run around the park and see how many calories I could burn in an hour. Uh, but then my friend Khan said he was game to do a cycling race. So we basically decided that we take an hour in the park, I'm gonna cycle, he's gonna run. Uh, so we run from the hole in the wall or cycle for an hour. The only rule is it has to be in the park. Uh, we measure it on Strava, and then whoever burns off the most calories in that hour, uh, obviously me, is gonna win, and then the loser, Khan, is gonna buy the winner uh, the amount of calories that they consumed in the hour in the Dash Container Cafe. So we'll go up to the park and uh, where we're ready for the off and we'll discuss a little bit of the strategy. So Connor's about to join me and I'm trying to figure out what his strategy is. Now, technically I should win. We're about the same weight. He's a bit younger than me, I'm 58. I don't know what age he is, but he's younger than me. About the same weight. He's on a bicycle. He's gonna to try to use, lose as many calories as an hour as he can on a bike. And I'm gonna try and lose as many calories as I can in an hour running. I've done some practice and I can do 9.31, I did it at the weekend on a relatively slow run in the park. Uh, so I'm gonna run a bit quicker because today I'm on, uh, I think it's stride training today for an hour. So we've got an hour to run around the park. I'm hoping to lose about a thousand calories. I think on a bicycle you lose less calories per hour than on a, a modestly talented cyclist against a modestly talented runner going at a modest rate would lose less calories. That's my plan anyway. I don't know what Khan's strategy is. Uh, mine is to run around the park. The roads are closed in part of it, but I wrecked it uh, as my coach Jim, my baseball coach Jim would always say, practice doesn't make perfect, perfect practice makes perfect. So I came up and tried to run the exact route and discovered the road was closed in advance. This was on Saturday or on Sunday. So what I'm, gonna, I'm hoping is, is that just naturally by running around the park, I will lose about a thousand calories. And I think that'll be more than Khan uh, is targeting. He sent me a text saying, oh, he thought 680. And how many did I think? So I said 681. So <laughs> I don't really know uh, what the, the reality of that is, but I'm gonna give it a go. Um, uh, so the idea is that we run around, or he cycles, we leave through the hole in the wall behind me, uh, go for an hour, come back, compare the calories on Strava, uh, I'm going to win. Then uh, he has to buy me that equivalent of calories in the Dash Container Cafe, which is behind us. So uh, hopefully it'll be a bit of fun. The weather is gorgeous now. It's supposed to rain. Uh, it's supposed to be raining this morning, but anyway, I think it's held off for a couple of hours. So uh, we should get going pretty soon. He should turn up. He's going to make another piece of camera. I'm going to try and video some as I go along. Uh, I'm not being carrying this big rig with me. Uh, I'll have a small GoPro in the pocket and uh, we'll just make a couple of pictures as we go along. <laughs> I'm going to win this one. I know I'm going to win this one. I better win this one. Anyway, after I've won this one, there'll be a few more challenges. So uh, hopefully we make a series out of them uh, where, where I always win. <laughs> okay, so uh, so my, 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 rival, uh, my rival has arrived. It's, look at that for a sponsored shot. Look at that. Look. Yeah. No sponsors for me. That's because you're a loser, baby. <laughs> All right, so. I'll leave it to you. I, I've already done my bit where I say you're useless. I've already, done, I've already done my bit where I say I'm going to lose. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm not going to try and guess your strategy, but we're going to leave through uh, that gate over there. And we both have an hour. You have an hour on the bicycle. Do you want to describe the bicycle? Yeah, I have my... This is a camera, by the way, if you looked at the yeah, camera. I thought what that is. Yeah. I have one of them too, look. Um, yeah. yeah, so I've got my standard road bike, my standard uh, compact uh, uh, cassettes on it. And uh, Garmin head unit just going to record the, uh, the, the 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 ride for the hour and I'll stop the stop the Garmin head unit at, after the hour and as Barry will say that he'll do the same and we'll compare the results okay you know the north road's closed 
So I see. Yeah. <laughs> practice does not make perfect. No. Perfect practice. I came out on Sunday. Yeah. <laughs> 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 right okay we'll t this rig's heavy we'll re we 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 we'll reconvene i'll put this in the car tidy up get the gopros ready and away we go yeah you game yeah Okay, so I'm running done. Uh, that's the running bit and the cycling bit finished. Uh, let's uh, go talk to Khan and see what the results are. Right. As a matter of interest, how many did you think you were going to do? I thought I was going to do about 650 to 680. Right. And how many did you think you were going to do? A thousand. Yeah, I thought you were going to do about a thousand. I was going to try for a thousand. Yeah. I didn't do a thousand. Yeah, I thought that you'd get, at, at, a, at an easy pace, you do about 600 calories. And so, if you went all effort, you could get up to 800 to a thousand. All right, here we go. Okay, so are you filming me? I'll film you. Right. 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 Okay. Do you want do you wanna go do you want me to go first? You go first, yeah. Okay. So ten point four one kilometers. Uh fifty six forty eight moving time. Uh five twenty seven pace, forty nine millimeters gain, one hundred and eighty two beats per minute, and nine hundred and thirty three calories. Cur tremendous. Right, so my ride by the numbers yeah. is distance 23.8 uh, kilometers. Yeah. Uh, elevation gain 22, uh, 221 meters. Wow. Moving time, one hour and four seconds. Ooh, uh, technical breach. Yeah, well, there's obviously something Go on, go on, go on, the, go on, uh, go on. The Garmin stopped. I, 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 let, I let you away with seconds. it. <laughs> go on. Uh, average power was 111 watts. Average speed was 23.8 kilometers. That's pretty good. 738 going. calories. Fair play to you. That's uh, that's more calories than I thought. Yeah, it's more anyway, calories than I thought. Anyway, uh, it's now your round to buy My me round. 933 yeah, yeah, yeah. calories worth of food before it rains. <laughs> okay, so we're off to the Dash Cafe, which is just literally through the hole in the wall and beside the hole in the wall pub. So hopefully when uh, the total lockdown eases, we can splash and dash. Uh, but for the moment, it's just the Dash Container Cafe. Khan goes there regularly, he lives nearby. Um, it's been outside my lockdown area for quite some time. Um, but he recommended a sausage roll, which turned out to be four sausages in a roll. Uh, <laughs> giant sausage roll. So my guess is it's four or 500 calories, I don't know. Uh, and then I had the Malcolm Elliott smoothie. There's also the Sean Kelly and the Sam Bennett, but I chose the, the mango one. The, anyway, I had the Elliott and it was fantastic. So here's some general shots and we'll munch on this and then we'll, uh, Review the data.
I hope you enjoyed the video of me running and con cycling in the park and then eating in the Dash Cafe. It was uh, a great bit of fun. I mean, it, was, it wasn't a fair fight in terms of that. I think a moderate uh, cyclist and a moderate uh, runner, uh, the runner will, will burn more calories per hour. So no matter what Khan did, uh, it would be really hard to burn the same amount of calories. Uh, so uh, Nico Roach, one of Ireland's professional cyclists, was in the paper saying he did uh, a six hour ride in a, in a race in a mountain stage and he burned 6,000 calories. So that's 1,000 calories an hour. If I was pushing it, I did 930 or something without really trying and stopping to take pictures and admire the deer and all this kind of stuff. Um, if I was pushing it, I reckon I'd do 1,000 calories in an hour. I'll actually, I'd go out in a couple of weeks and, and, and just do it for the sake of it. Um, but I think that a, a cyclist, and a runner going at the same rate with roughly the same ability, you'll burn more off on a on a run. I looked at a video that Khan sent me on GCN where, and I wondered what Khan's strategy would be in the park to try and increase it. In fact, I thought he did really well to, to do the 720. Um, but I thought he might go up steep hills where you'll burn a lot of calories, but then going down, you won't burn as much calories. And when you're Everesting, that's a really good technique. Um, but I've seen on the GCN video where people, when they're going downhill, they're applying the brakes and pushing against the brakes, which is, it seems like really tough going. But all things being equal, running will burn more calories per hour than cycling. I hope you enjoyed the video and found it useful. If you did, it'd be great if you hit the like button. I'll put some links in the description below and answer any questions that you pop into the comments. Uh, there'll be a big blue subscribe button there and some associated videos, including cons there. Thanks for watching. Until the next video, just keep running or indeed cycling along. I was kidding about the Malcolm Elliott. It is, of course, the Shea Elliott, but I thought I might get a rise out of Con and his uh, cycling buddies. Chapeau!